The new mechs and first vehicle have just dropped onto the battlefield, and we're here to tell you everything you need to know about them. The first thing to know is that they're awesome. They have more firepower than a rocket sentry and a gatling sentry combined. Uh, they kind of just bring unmitigated liberation to everything in front of them. But let's talk details. They can be purchased from the ship management console for 20,000 requisition credits. And they come with a 10 minute cooldown and two uses per mission. When calling them down, they are near immediately delivered by our very own Pelican, complete with its autocannon. It has a healthy set of armor, making it largely impervious to small arms fire and small bug melee attacks. Which is very nice, because this mech sacrifices resilience for raw firepower. Sporting a rocket launcher and a minigun, these mechs can single-handedly clean up entire bug breaches, chargers and bile titans included. For as long as they have ammo. There is no reloading these guys, so no keeping these mechs around for the long term. Drop your toy and smash everything you can. This mech, however, is not without drawbacks. It makes a lot of noise, so expect everything nearby to come hunt you down. What's more is that these mechs are not built to take hits. At all. Their armor is enough to keep the little things away, but anything hard-hitting is incredibly lethal. Chargers, bile titans, rockets, or explosives in general would destroy the mech near immediately, so keep those threats in check. In terms of first impressions, I find the rockets are the biggest part of the mech. The minigun has enough ammo to spread around, but with a total reserve of 14 rockets, they need to be used sparingly and save for targets which require their anti-armor services. Our chargers come running, one rocket to the leg and minigun to finish it off. The bile titan comes spidering at you. Uh, two to three rockets directly to the face will clear that out. Ammo efficiency is a high priority when piloting a mech, as once your anti-armor options are depleted, the mech becomes near defenseless. But that's where your team comes in. A squad mate can remove the hostile anti-armor, and your mech can provide cover to your team as you blast through it all. I look forward to doing my part in liberating the galaxy from tyranny, which you guys can come and watch live right here on this channel, so hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next tips and tricks video.